Good evening. Breaking as we come on the air tonight, word that Paul Pelosi, the victim of a brutal hammer attack at the hands of a home intruder, has been released from a San Francisco hospital. His release coming just days after the office of House Speaker Nancy Pelosi revealed he faced a long recovery. This is we learn more details about the man accused of brutally attacking him after breaking into his home on Friday. Let's get right to Miguel Almaguer in San Francisco. Miguel, what have you learned? Well, Lester, good evening. It was just six days ago that Paul Pelosi was attacked by a man with a hammer inside the home you see here behind me. We now know that Mr. Pelosi is back home recovering from serious injuries, including a skull fractured and an injured arm and hand. The 82-year-old spent several days in the ICU. In a new statement, the Pelosi family says Paul remains under doctor's care as he continues to progress on a long recovery process. Earlier today, activity around the Pelosi home was our first indication that he had returned to the residence tonight nearly a week after that attack security here at the home is visible both the capitol police and local police are here lester and miguel i understand you've gathered more information about the suspect yeah, 42-year-old David DePap is a Canadian citizen who entered the U.S. back in 2008. Officials say he overstayed his visa. He was here illegally. Lester, he has pled not guilty. He's expected to be in court at the end of this week, Lester. All right, Miguel, thank you. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.